I was browsing through the Android apps subreddit recently, and I found a post from someone asking how the community would set up an Android device to launch an application right when said device boots up. So in today's video, I'll be showing you exactly how that is done. Now there are a number of ways that we can make this happen, since there are quite a few automation apps available in the Google Play Store. Some OEMs have even begun baking in their own automation system into their firmware, but in an attempt to make this as universal as possible, I'll show you how this is done using Macrodroid. I do understand that other apps like Tasker are more powerful as they can automate more things, but until the UI is redesigned, I just can't recommend it to people who are not already familiar with it. To me, Macrodroid is just easier to understand and it still covers the majority of what people want in an automation application. You can start by simply searching for Macrodroid in the Google Play Store, but I'll also include a direct link to this application down in the video description for those who would prefer that. Once installed, let's open up this application. You can choose to allow or not allow notifications. And then we're going to tap through the introduction cards. From here, we want to add a new macro to the application. So let's tap on the add macro button. And this is where we will set up our trigger and our action. If you're wanting to do something when the device boots up, we first need to set up the trigger. So let's tap on the plus icon from within the trigger card. And then we're going to tap the magnifying glass up here at the top to initiate a search. Let's just search for the term boot. And it's going to filter out everything else except for device boot. So let's tap on device boot to finish setting up that trigger. Now we're wanting this macro to open up an application or game when it has been triggered. So let's tap on the plus icon within the actions card. And then we're simply gonna tap on the application category up here at the top. You can see there is a launch application option. So let's tap on that. And then you're going to see this requires draw overlays permission request. This is just how Android's permission system is set up. So if you want this macro to work, we need to toggle it on for the macro droid application. So let's tap on OK. And then find the macro droid application in this list. And tap the toggle to enable it. Now we can go back and then select the launch application option again. You can either choose to enter a package name or simply select an application. We're going to go with the default option of selecting an application and then it's going to give us a list of all of the apps that we have installed. In today's example, we're just going to open up Chrome when the device boots up. So I'm going to tap on Chrome here. And Macrodroid has some optional settings for launching an application as a trigger. In my testing, neither of these are required. However, you may find them useful in your specific use case. So in this example, I'm not going to select either of these. I'm just going to tap on OK. And this takes us back to the Add Macro screen, where we can see that when the device boots up, we are going to launch an application. Let's go ahead and name this to boot up. You can name the macro anything you want. We're going to tap the back button so that we can save the macro. And then you should not only see your macro in this list from within the macros tab, but it also should be enabled. We can disable this with a toggle but we want this enabled so that when the device boots up, the application is launched. 
Let's go ahead and restart the phone. So that you can see this type of automation is possible on Android and that what we just set up actually works. So all we need to do is now unlock the phone and then macro droid will kick in and it will launch that application or game that you just set up. You can see everything worked as planned, but there are a number of different ways that we can use this type of automation on Android. I do hope this video helped anyone out who is curious about automating things on Android. The Macro Droid application is free in the Google Play Store, and it makes setting things up like this incredibly easy, and it is a great option for launching an app or a game right when the device boots up. If you got stuck along the way, or simply have a question about Android in general, please don't hesitate to leave a comment down below. I'll do my best to reply and help out as soon as I'm able to.